Hey, what's up guys? It's Matt here, and today I got a commentary for you, or more like a pack opening commentary. So anyways, I went ahead and I bought like, I don't know, 40 packs worth of um, premium packs. Uh, this is going to be actually a pretty good pack opening. I hope you guys enjoy it. And also, this is the start of a second... Oh, there goes my phone. This is the start of a second giveaway. So... I would like to talk about that. To be entered into the giveaway, you need to be subscribed to the channel and you need to leave a comment on the channel. And I think it's going to be one, two, three, four, five. The best five comments on the channel are going to receive one of five players. And there will be, like last time, the first person to get in contact with me that I selected the winner on Sunday. So stay tuned for Sunday will be able to choose which one they get and the players are as follows james carpenter 93 left guard rodney hudson 94 center a mean joe green collectible um a stephen pie and trey mason 93 halfback and i love that trey mason 93 halfback you guys will too he is honestly amazing um I've never had a problem like with cutting through any holes or literally um, screen plays probably work the best with Trey Mason. Uh, I find that he runs for a lot and then counters. Counters work really well with him. Uh, James Carpenter I haven't used too much. Uh, Rodney Hudson I haven't used too much. That Mean Joe Green collectible. Um, yeah, I don't know too much about it. I'm just, we have a Mean Joe Green already. We have the 95 and he's pretty good so I'm not worried about the Ultimate Legend. Um, and then Stephen Pye, I don't know too much about. So these pack o this pack over was actually pretty fucking good. I was really stoked about it. Um, everything just went like really well. And also I, I pulled a lot of good guys. Um, you'll see like three elites in one fucking pack. I was like, okay. Um, just a little update, but um, I wouldn't worry about building. Um, ultimate legends because elite badges are on the rise again elite badges are i think like at this time of the video they're like 50k but like as the day has progressed on they're now at like 57 almost 60 so if you take that into consideration that you need three or four elite badges for each guy that's like over 180k that you're going to spend just in badges to build the people and it's not going to be worth it if you pull the badges though sometimes it can be worth it but just watch it like I don't pull any of the badges in these badge packs but I got a lot of gold badges and a lot of silver badges so it's definitely worth it if you're looking for badges out of these packs uh, let's see well it's oh, just a little update um, what's going on in my life right now um, my grandfather I that's why I hadn't posted in two days I texted Scott uh, yesterday I was like hey can you cover for me today because I was um, I was actually living up in the hospital with my grandfather. He had to go into emergency surgery for uh, his kidneys or else he wouldn't be here today. So, yeah, that's what's been going on there. Um, other than that, let's see, Red Sox winning last night. I was excited about that. I was definitely stoked because I had nothing else to do in the emergency room, so I watched that. And I watched um, a Jerome... Bets, bet, Bettis, um, with James Harrison uh, interview that they did on uh, ESPN or like Sports Center, whatever I was watching in the ER room, and um, it was actually kind of cool. So I learned a little bit about them. And uh, James Harrison's on my team. I never knew much about him. So if you guys uh, want to check that out, I think ESPN has it on their website as well. It's actually kind of cool. Um, but this this pack opening man i definitely like these packs are hit or miss so if you guys are still pulling packs i know it's kind of late in mud i'm just doing it just to bring you guys some new content and also keep you guys updated on mud and give you guys a giveaway because i like giving back to the community um if you guys are still pulling these packs on mud listen they're hit or miss if they're hot keep pulling them if they're not stop pulling them don't waste your money or coins whatever you're using to pull them um, let's see, uh, another thing about them, you want to make sure that you clear your binder because you get a solid, I think it's 
12 or 14 cards come like out of the entire pack and um, Madden usually doesn't leave you hanging either they usually give you a large quick sell um, those signature series things that you see me get in here I get like two or three of them and then uh, they'll give you the quick sell or an extra pack I've noticed that I've gotten like a few pro packs a few um, all Madden like random packs I heard a few people have gotten legendary packs out of them. Uh, one person got an, uh, a Lombardi pack, and the other one got a what the hell is that other thing? They're all not all that, but um, I, I'm blanking out on it. It's um, the blue one with I think Andre Reed on the front. It's, um, Jesus, I can't remember. This is kind of sad. And I, oh, game changers. <laughs> I should know that because I pulled the, the shit out of those. <laughs> every time there was a game changer so um, anyways we had um, a few additions to the squad if you guys are looking to pick up some good people um, that 99 Calvin Johnson is pretty good I definitely recommend him for your squad he goes up he gets the ball um, right now you'll see at the end of this that we've been rocking to um, big corners we picked up 99 night train um, just a regular version and he does really well um, and then we also picked up 99 Charles Woodson the corner edition and he is crazy good also great on returning the ball so if you need a returner in a corner go for him or Patrick Peterson's another good bet and then for corner number three who um, has been kind of clutch for us lately is 97 Darrell Rivas uh, he's a very much a finesse player but he is really really good and has great coverage um, so if you're looking on the defensive side of the ball, definitely check him out. Um, uh, let's see, who else? Um, definitely some, if you're looking to make defensive improvements, I can give you a lot of hints on defensive improvements. Um, but pretty much with offense, you kind of want to talk to Brad. And he'll be posting here pretty quick, hopefully. So if you're looking for offensive stuff, definitely want to talk to him about it because we're still in the process of upgrading our offensive line we we're uh, talking about that today and in case you guys don't know brad and i share a team it's on my account and um he's really good at budgeting a team and that's where my fault is is really budgeting and uh getting the best team and everything so we work hand in hand and we have a great team and we play online and all the solos and everything so we kind of grind together but um if you're looking for help, uh, him and I work side by side and uh, we'll try to uh, help you out. Leave co questions in the comments. We'll answer questions for you. Um, but anything else, uh, definitely feel free to contact us. I know um, Efren did and he got the last giveaway, one of um, three because the other two did not get in contact with me. So um, definitely make sure you get in contact with me if you uh, comment and subscribe on this video make sure that you pay attention for sunday sunday i'm going to release another video and it'll, it'll probably be an online gameplay and it'll say who the winners are so there will be five winners make sure you, you tell your friends uh that we're doing this giveaway so that way many people can get a chance at winning some great cards um but anyways this has been matt and i'm out i hope you all have a great day